Hello everybody. It's Marsha from Kansas Misfit and we are checking the, the hay on the cattle. As soon as I get there, driving around the, uh, our field and checking the cattle, seeing if they need any hay. Haven't found the cattle yet, but they're out here. When they, when they see the vehicle, they're probably going to think, hmm, they're coming. I'm looking for the bale holders that you put the bale, bale, bale of hay in. There's some hedge trees. Haven't found them yet, but we're heading there. Oh, I hate the bouncy bouncies. Hope I don't have a flat tire. <laughs> There's a cow. Where? In the lick bucket. Oh, I see it. <laughs> okay, can you guys see the cattle? Straight in front. I'm gonna try to find the bale holders and see how much. Look at all those hedge trees. Hedge apples. Looks like there's no hay in there, so he's gonna have to come and feed the. There's a baby cow right there. Can I just play that See the baby? Oh, by yourself. Mm -hmm. you I don't see it. I'm trying to see it. Can you see it? I can't tell. Can you see it? It's laying right there in front of that log. I can't. Can you zoom in? No. <gasps> One. Well, I hope you can see it. I'm driving forward now so we can check the hay, see if the cattle needs some hay. Someone's parked on the street over there in the corner. Lots of lick tubs. And grow garden in that. Looks like the hay's empty, doesn't it? In that hay bale, that, that, the blue things. It's really It's low. empty. Yeah, he needs to fill them up. The other one looks like they have a lot more on that one. Oh no, those two over there are empty. See the bay hailers, a hail bay, the cows and stuff, and the hedge trees. Lots of hedge apples there on the ground. Anyway, I checked the cows, and yes, we need to have some hay brought in. Aren't they beautiful? Hi, macaroni and cheese. Can see I the get see the white see the white um, faced cow looking at us. It just now turned its face. David calls it macaroni and cheese. I'll pet them. If they let you pet them, you can go ahead and walk over there and see. But I don't think they will. Just don't spook them, they'll run. <laughs> I guess Amber wants to try to pet the cows from uh, her channel is Survival Prep Homestead. So, go check her out. I don't know that it has electric fence on there as well, so be careful. I don't I don't know what which one's uh hooked up to electric, so be careful.
Why don't you pull a handful of hay out of this bale and give it to them? They don't want my weeds. Nope, they don't like weeds. They like the good stuff. Just pull, pull a little bit out. They'll like that. Just drop it on the ground and they'll come. And then you might can touch it. I don't know. Maybe not. They're leery, but they're coming. We don't usually pet them, so they might not come to you. Anyway, as you can see, the hay bellers are empty. So, another trip to feed the cattle. You can throw that on the ground and go grab another handful, and by that time they'll be up towards the fence, maybe. Uh, there is a baby with white hair. Uh huh. So cute. We still need to go get a bill of hay to take to your house. That one's almost here. Yeah. Red light, green light. <laughs> I'll go get more. Ow. Ow, you either. <laughs> We're going to have to get ready, so one's coming. So, Joe, if you're watching this, what do you think of your wife feeding the cow? Comment in the comment section and let me know.
Well, I checked the cows and now we're heading out to go get a bale of hay for my daughter's chickens. And maybe we'll add that to the video, maybe not, but I probably won't. I think this is good enough for this video. If you really enjoyed watching my daughter feed the cows, it's her first time doing it and I think she has enjoyed it. And looks like the cows got a few bites. And we are going to head out and smash the like button if you enjoyed this. And for more videos like this, comment what you like so I can tell what kind of things I can comment on when I do my videos. So I guess I'll let you go for now. Hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. It's beautiful out. And tomorrow is Halloween. So let's see what we can do for tomorrow. Have a good day. Ta-ta.